Okay, in this video, I will be sharing with you on how I release the air from Vulcan 1 and Vulcan 2 and how I adjust the regulator, increasing and decreasing the regulated air. So first thing we need to do is to uh, release the air. It must be completely empty. First, we need the uh, 24mm socket to release the air. Okay. And now while, while waiting to empty, now we'll remove the stop by using 5mm allen key. Then remove the connecting connect trigger connector. Three mm Allen key. Loose the two screws of the cylinder. Yeah. These two screws just loosen, and we can now remove the cylinder. Okay. Uh, now it's zero. We can now easily we can now easily remove the end cap. So this is the end cap and there's a spacer inside and that's the regulator. Now to remove this we need we need a rod with a 0.7 mm uh, um, thread. Then a vice grip. Now we're going to uh, adjust the regulator. First, we will remove the bolt. Okay. After we after we remove the bolt, let's measure the <coughs> let's measure the length of the um, regulator. So the measure is 62 mm. So this is the factory settings. It's around 860 or 880 uh, feet per second. So by by using uh, 4 mm Allen key to decrease the pressure is by turning clockwise that is to decrease the regulator and by increasing the regulator uh, just counterclockwise okay so before it's 62 
Now it's around 63 millimeters. So I just only adjusted the uh, 1 mm. And that's enough. <clears throat> but if you want uh, if you want to increase more the pressured air or the regulated air, you need to uh, use a stronger spring. Uh, just replace the old spring here, the old spring, and use stronger spring for uh, higher pressure. Then after we adjusted, put back the the bolt, put back the bolt, yeah. and then put it back. That's all.